welcome back to Councilman Estate Winery. I'm Linnea, here in the very appropriately named Oak Room to talk about the big question. Why Oak a wine? Today we're going to be looking at two Chardonnays, one oaked, one unoaked. It's the easiest type of wine to see the difference between the two that we have here at Consulman. So one's been oaked for a full 18 months, the other one not at all. What does that change in the wine? Well, you're looking at two main things when you talk about oaking a white. Even a red, but it's even more clear in a white. Um, you're changing the fruit character as well as some of the acids in the wine. Fruit character in wine is naturally there because it comes from a fruit, tastes like grapes. As you put that wine into an oak barrel, it changes some of those flavors and replaces the, some of the fruit flavor that's in there with some of that woody oak flavor. You're also getting some of the tannin from the oak, not the same type of tannin as you get in the red wine that dries you right out, but certain tannins that add ageability to the wine, that add certain levels and depths of flavor to that wine. Other than the fruit character, we of course have to address the acids. Those were the, that was the other of the two things that I said change when we oak a wine. So if you tasted this unoaked Chardonnay first, you're gonna get what I describe as green apple acid. Malic acid is the scientific name for it. It's crisp, it's light, it adds that kind of refreshing burst of flavor to your mouth. It's very pleasant, very summery, we say when it comes to wine, it's very crisp. Um, if you put that wine into oak, that malic acid actually undergoes something like big fancy words around here. Malolactic fermentation. Malolactic fermentation. Try saying that six times fast after a bottle of Renault Chardonnay. It's not gonna happen. Oh. But basically what's happening is you're converting those acids, the malic acids, into lactic acids through that process. And lactic acid is, of course, what you have with lactose, milk acid. So that's what gives you that buttery, creamy flavor and texture in an oaked Chardonnay. So unoaked, crisp, light, fruity, oaked Chardonnay, you're gonna have this buttery, rich, deep wine. Thanks again for coming by the Oak Room today here at Consulman Estate Winery with me, Linnea. Um, if you could check us out on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, any other social media that we have, that'd be great. If you wanna come by and see me at the winery, you're always welcome to do that too. Thank you so much.